Okay, so I rinsed it and then dyed it, left it in the dye tank for about 10 minutes, and now I'm boiling it. So I boil for 30 minutes, and then I'll show you what it looks like when it's done. Okay, so we're done boiling. Nice deep red color there. So when you're doing this, try to avoid or resist the urge to immediately yank it out of the boiling water because then some of the water will just flash off and you'll be left with streaks. So what I've done is I've dumped some cold water in there to cool it down a little bit and let it sit for a while. So it's cool enough that I can stick my fingers in there anyway. So I'm going to pull this out. The red really doesn't come through on the video. Well, sometimes it does, but get the angle right. Maybe. Anyway, it's a really deep red color. Could have left it anodizing for longer to get a little bit deeper pores. More more dye would have taken in then, but uh, I think it's great. So, there it is. Anodized part at home.